Hello everyone, and welcome back to another episode of our Versus Sport Save. So as my lighting is a mess because I'm recording during the day and I don't have the best equipment, but yay! <laughs> I look like a mess. Um, yeah, so I thought we would uh, come back to things here. Obviously, as I said, we'll, we'll come back after the uh, winter break. And it is finished up. Um, annoyingly, things have not gotten any better in the club atmosphere with the managerial support. It was like significantly better. It was really like it was really good, and then it just dipped down again. Um, I don't know why. Like promises wise, we improved. We improved the managerial support and all that stuff, but it, like didn't actually improve. So I don't really know too much of why that's the case. But I don't know. We'll we'll see what it is. Uh, but yeah, so let's make sure I try to stay in front of the light. Um, yeah, um, where, where's the best way to show you that? Nope, nope, nope. Just want to highlight. <laughs> so here, EU National. What? How are you in EU National? What? Hold on a second. Who else is? Where is he also? Oh, he's also German. That makes sense. Um, but so right now, these four are going to be leaving. Um, I'm going to try to get uh, get him to stay, because obviously there's the potential there and stuff. Um, I'm going to try to see if I can maybe get some money for him now, and if not, and then uh, Hassan just wants to leave, I doubt I'll be able to get him back, especially because the club has capped our wage spending on uh, 2300 I think. Yeah, but I did resign a few people though. So like potential wise, we've resigned him. Um, I'm not him, but uh, him, him. It's yeah. But there's a few people that we've like resigned and got got in for a while, which is really nice. So that we'll we'll keep them around. But but yeah, the these two, uh, which are big losses, obviously. But um, they're probably gonna leave because. It just makes sense, but chunk leaving is massive because, like, look at just the <laughs> the wage budget difference is cut in half. And right now, we need all the money we can get. So if we can avoid doing that, and I can maybe get them off earlier, that'd be great. Obviously, there is in the youth intake a massive amount of wingers coming through that are a high level. So hopefully, we, hopefully we can uh, replace him with that. Um, and yeah, swap those. Uh, but yeah, I think that's kind of what we'll go with. Obviously, this is the formation that we used the game before and did really well when we switched to it. So we might try to stick with it again. Um, and yeah, I think we'll just kind of see how things go. Obviously, he, this man is suspended. So we'll just swap those two. Get you in there. You're tired, though. Hmm. That would be a problem. But yeah, uh, I, there's nothing really else has happened. A few staff and stuff may be leaving us. Um, I don't know, I was trying to get some contracts in. I gotta look at the job market and stuff because you can see um, we have these guys here, oh, besides me, um, these guys who all would be leaving as of right now and then a few on the, uh, the second team. What? Second, huh? I didn't even know there was a second team. And then these guys, uh, then just coach should be leaving. So we'll see. Obviously, I'm not certain. So I kind of just got to play the market and look around. But I'm not going to do it now. I'm going to wait till much later in the season once we're uh, farther along. And uh, yeah, that's kind of it, really. Um, I think we're just trying to get the dynamics improved and everything. But we're going to face off against these two guys today. Uh, San Sanilu Spor. I think that's how you say it. And uh, Tarsus Iy. So they, um, obviously these guys are up to the table. We did beat them earlier in the year, and uh, these guys are here. So obviously, look, we're on 24 points. We are only two games away from fourth place. So it's not terrible. We're, we're only going away from 10th, but there's definitely ability to move up the table. We do have a good gap to the relegation spots. Um, they do want us to reach this playoffs, which is going to be really tough. Um, but yeah, so we'll, we'll see. But if we can improve performances and get a little more nailed down on what we're doing, I think we'll be in a be in a very good spot. So, without further ado, might as well get into the game. Options and instructions for sure. 
but they suggest him playing out there. I mean, it's not the worst idea in the world. Honestly, he could be a really good fullback. Come to think of it. Like, actually, it's, it's like, I mean, I know the crossing isn't there, but he's got some good attributes that could work with it otherwise. So, may, I don't know, maybe. Maybe I'll just shout there for that position. Because that is going to be a bit of one. But that's worth a shot. We'll try it. But otherwise, I'm pretty happy with the team. So, let's get into it. through the press conference. All right, we are at home in our massive stadium with like nobody in it. <laughs> Give encouragement. We've lifted a ball up over the top, can't really get it. To Guler and they had it clear and they whack it long and he runs right through the middle, uncontested. I, I just can't believe this this sometimes of how idiotically shit our defender look at this just just no one goes to him at all I just don't have words to describe it it's so bad Alright. It's fine. We can get it there. Hassan's been fouled, but we can get him in behind. Can he find the finish? He cannot. Oh! Oh! We got a penalty on it! Let's go! Let's go! Who's going to step up to take it? I have all the takers set. I've honestly forgot at this point. Alright, Hassan. Yes, Hassan! All right, all right, that's a big one. 1-1, one, one, and they're up at the top of the table. 2-4 and 7 room so far. All right, they've got shots, which is fine. This, this formation we have is not designed to maintain the possession. Uh, yeah, we'll do that. Man mark. So we have 6.4 and 6.5, these two, 6.7 there. 6.4 is the only area of concern, and Guler is struggling a little bit on the wing. So maybe those two might need to look at... Oh no. Goalkeeper! Are you kidding me? I... This team is just painful. It's just mistakes here and there. Like, no need to head that there. No need. And then this is just... He gets two hands to it. He cannot let that in. Let's just drop the line a little bit. Can't let that happen. So no, let's just let's do this. Um take him off. For this guy. Um, with that said. Okay, let's try to force it down the right too. Oh 
Oh. So. Oh. Come on. Good header. We've got it. Can we try to win it? Yes, we can. Nice job. No. Just trying to do a little too much there. Nope. Oh, I even dropped the line as well. That's good. That's good. Good. Force him into a mistake. So we got a 6.4 there. I said go for the floated crosses and hit early ones. Or maybe a little more direct. Right, set piece here. Blocked. Can we get this though? No. Alright, come on. Good job. Good, good, good. <laughs> when the, like, in front of him. This guy's injured too. You're in front of him. We force them back. Oh, you have to step there tighter and win that. Nice. Oh, but I almost go direct, but he needs to be running in behind there. You can't just play the ball and have him be static. Oh my god, in the gap. What are you doing? Why are you staying there? Drop! It's a lower line! Look at this! He wins the header and just stands there! So many problems with the defense of this team. There's so many. Just mistakes here and there. It's like we stat wise we did well too. More XG, almost same shot, same position, but just stupid things. It's the it's the same thing every time. It's our center backs don't know how to fucking deal with a forward. They're so bad positionally, they're so bad in the air. I cannot believe it. I set the training for the week for to work on aerial stuff for to work on defensive positioning. But no, nothing works for them. They're awful together, but I don't have much of an alternative. See you then, just to possibly work together. That's what I'm going to do next game. Oh, that guy's injured. Great. Alright, well, let's give these guys a bit of a rest. Hopefully that will do something, and I will then skip ahead to the next game, and I will uh, 
see you guys then. All right, guys, we're now back at the uh, next game. So, um, we'll see. <laughs> Interesting they don't have a successful formation, but um, most vulnerable to facing uh, wide formations, it appears. Um, we'll also do that. I think we will see if the lower line of engagement worked. I thought it kind of helped out a bit. Um, so we'll see how that, we'll try that again just in case, but if not, we'll change it back. Um, for sure, um, I want to try this back line today. We still thought we're good. Um, we'll see just up top, I'm not certain, but we'll, we'll try it. Um, it's not been great, this guy. But it's just, this is the thing, like, we don't have many players in certain positions, so. We'll see how that goes. And uh, I kind of want to try to force it down the right this game. So we'll see how this goes. There we go. That's nice to see. I think I actually want to try to force it down both sides. Just because it does says that you guys struggle with a little more width, so we'll try this. Encourage from the start. Nice. Oh, nothing there. Alright. Our goalie's got it here. Where is he going to go with the ball? He's gone very long. We should easily get on this. Oh! Hassan's got it. Can he get in and get a shot off? He can and he can finish. That's a brilliant start. That's a brilliant start for us. It's a brilliant start. Exactly how I need to start this game. Corner for them. <sighs> that guy's just completely unmarked on the back pose. Another one for them. All right. Who? No, no, no. corners. Where Mark? He's the guy in the back post. Let's just stick an extra guy in there. All the same height. He's on the far post too. Actually, no, let's do this. Um, stick you right there. All right, let's see if that doesn't make a bit of a difference on set pieces to hopefully stop that from happening. So we don't have to, I know it's been marking, but at least maybe we can just stick a body in there. I mean, we haven't had a set piece opportunity, so I'm hoping that did something. All right, they've got it here, clipped it up. Can we get ahead on it? No, but keeper's got it, keeper's got it. All right, highlight's still going. We can get that, can we get on it? We can. Nice, can we find a pass? This is lovely football. This is lovely. Oh! Oh! <laughs> what a hit that was! That was really a wonderful goal. Still going though. Can we get a cross in? Nope. Well, that would have been a hell of a finish. All right. Done somewhat decent so far. We need to improve. Do we want to keep him on? So we haven't been great, but the defense has been really good so far. 
Let's just stay right now for, for how we're doing. It's actually just struggling a lot. They've got a corner here. Good job. Oh no, that's a horrible clearance. You've you've one spot where there's a player and the rest of the field, and you clear it right to him. I I mean it just feels like this game doesn't want me to do. Look at this. He's got all this space. Just that way. That way. Up here. Our player can get it. It's the one spot their guy is. Right, let's give him a shot as an inside forward. And you can try up top. We'll try that crosses. Give it a shot. Easily. Why? Close him down more. What are you doing? What is this? Look at look at this. It looks like he's gonna get there. It honestly looks like he should be able to get there first. But no. And then how did neither of those two get on it is the, the other question. And who's the one that's... It's the striker! Why do we cannot guard a fucking striker for the life of us? It's impossible. This team has no idea how to guard one. Do you have any decent marking? Are you competent at marking at all? Ten. Ten. You're, you're both fucking incompetent. Let's see if that'll make a difference. What? thing No one there. Can we get ahead on this? Come on, guys, put some pressure. Can we get some pressure? Stop the all right, that's fine. It's difficult head to chance. Don't have a nine. We don't have a single good fucking striker. Same thing again. We can go into the lead early or, or get it back, and then we just blow it on the dumbest things. The dumbest things. Oh 
Probably should have just defended for the game. Or whatever. Probably dropped closer to the relegation zone. Yeah, now we're only three points away. It's ridiculous. It's just like the, the dumbest mistakes they make. They're so bad. Each go I just pick apart them all with such horrible mistakes they make. I don't know what to tell them. Like, at this point, it's just ridiculous. Oh, like, how am I supposed to tell them not to let someone run through the middle of the field? Two of you are there, they just let him run through. How am I? It's set to counter press. It's set to press immediately. It's set to mark. It's set to all this. Nothing. Like, I get that there's stats that matter with these things, but, like, you should just at least do it. There's a difference between doing something and not. And too often, I see them do stupid things or make stupid decisions that I can't believe. That Both those goals from last game. What are you guys doing? What are you guys doing? No one covers. No one marks. No, they leave the guy on the back post. It's fine. I'm okay to let them have it outside because I want us to cover deep and cover off. But they clear it. There's that one guy out over there. But, you, but no, clear it to that where that guy is. Making it harder on yourself to clear that ball. Clear it into the open space upfield. It's just like small things like that that they shouldn't be doing. But they make the mistakes. Just can't believe it. Oh. Just feels like nothing wants to go right with this team. Nothing does. Alright, well, the next episode is we're going to face off against these guys and these two. So these are going to be the next two we face. So Ahmed Sportif and Quorum FK are going to be the ones we uh, face off against next. And hopefully uh, we can do well enough against them and make some kind of... Uh, impact and in the uh, next five games or so hopefully I can do something I mean if we look back this was a stretch that we did decent so I think we beat these guys last time 3-1 now we can't even manage to beat them so snowing but hopefully we can get some kind of result against these guys and make a difference and see if we don't get smacked some of those guys again but yeah all right well thank you guys so much for watching if you did like the video please remember to like and subscribe and if you want to catch up on any of the highlights that you've missed from these past games here, you can remember that there, uh, if you do remember, there is YouTube Shorts as well as our TikTok, which has all the highlights for you. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Have a wonderful day where you are in the world, and I'll see you in the next one.